Hi, welcome to Sid's Tips. And sometimes when I do a video, I realize, oh, I should have done it this way or I should have done it that way. And somebody made a really good point to my last video I did on the icebreaker, and that is running it under hot water to loosen this product up to making it easier to get the ice cubes out. And that's what I wanted to show you, and that's what I do now. So after I run this through the freezer overnight and it's nice and solid as it is now, I then run the product under warm water to loosen up and then I crush it. So that's what I wanted to share with you on this video. I'm going to demonstrate it to you because otherwise I have found that when you just go in and crush the unit it and then try to shake it, the ice still stays stuck. So what you want to do again, make sure that you have warm to hot water, run it underneath and you'll start hearing the cracking inside of the ice and that makes it so much easier and especially hot water, so which is great because these cubes are solid from sitting in the freezer for overnight. And there we go. So now, got that done. Now I'm gonna go ahead and crush it. And I absolutely love the product. And this is great, especially if you live in an apartment or you live in a home as well that doesn't have a filter system to your ice maker. And that really helps. So let's go ahead and see how we're doing and there we go the all the ice is loosened up and then what I do I put that right into my ice tray ready to go then for my future use and then I've got one more I got two so I'm gonna do again the same thing and you, you start hearing the cracks And this is nice and hot water, so this really loosens it up. I'm making a nice little mess here on my sink. But again, now I can crush it and open it up. And then there we go. The ice is now ready to come out. And this really makes it so much easier to use the product. And I thank the person that commented on my last video. And I realized as I was starting to do that as well, uh, that I felt like maybe I should do another video because I made it look more difficult than it should be by doing it this way. So if you're finding that uh, you're crushing it and the ice gets stuck, just run it under warm to hot water. And then you could see all the ice will come out quickly and easily. All right, everybody, let me know if you have any questions. Really appreciate your time and if you ever see one of my videos and there's a suggestion you have, I'm always opening to listen. Hope this is of help. Thanks so much. Have a great day.